Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. As much as I would love to be doing the before and after video of this deck, uh, we're having a little bit of a supply issue and I don't have my fascia boards to finish it off. So those I thought were going to be here last Tuesday are going to be here this coming Tuesday, but I'll still have it done before Father's Day. So the Saturday before Father's Day should be the big reveal before and after. But I have to power wash this deck. The whole point of having Trex is the low maintenance and that you never have to paint it or stain it. All you have to do is power wash it. Well, I had an electric power washer. It was a Ryobi little uh, 18, 1900 PSI Ryobi, and it lasted, you know, five years or so. It was actually a pretty decent power washer for what it was, but uh, it died, so I had to get another one, so I chose this DeWalt. Now, it is a DeWalt, and part of the reason I like DeWalt tools, but the biggest reason is right here, powered by Honda. This DeWalt power washer has a Honda GCV 170 whatever that means. It's a Honda engine, and that's why I bought it. Uh, I like Honda engines. They seem to, you all know about Honda engines, don't you? I think you do. Anyway, so I'm going to get this unboxed, and uh, we'll check it out. Boom, there it is. Hey, 3,100 PSI compared to just under 2,000. That's going to be good. Um, one thing that was nice is I had this uh, attachment from the Ryobi. This is one of those, like, super powerful uh, tips and it uh, of course is universal so it works on this i don't think i'm going to be using that first off with 3100 psi i'll probably start with you know maybe maybe their 40 or 15 degree uh nozzle and you know i don't want to put a hole in the deck i just want to get it clean so let's fire it up So first impressions, well, let's start off with all the good, of course, and wow, that's a lot of power. Um, I'm used to that little electric Ryobi and this 3100 PSI gas. Well, I mean, it stands to reason, it's a lot more powerful, and it did a fantastic job of getting the deck clean. Uh, number two, I really like the way this engine started. It's a Honda, and I expected nothing less. Uh, first time starting it, I pulled it, what, three times and it started? Now, there is a difference in the manual from what I'm finding on this engine. I'm looking for the choke, and there's no choke. Um, I don't know. I, I looked all over, and obviously it didn't need choked to start it. So I, I don't think this actually has a choke, even though it says in the manual that there's a choke. Uh, another thing that is really good about this Honda engine is down here, they give you a fuel cutoff. So when you're running the engine and you don't know when the next time you're gonna use it is, maybe it's getting towards the fall and you're gonna put it away, you can switch that to fuel shut off and let the fuel run out of the carburetor before you shut it off completely. And it runs the gas out of the carburetor, keeps the carburetor clean, and of course will extend the life of this wonderful Honda engine. Another good thing about this is the size of it. It's very portable, light, and easy to move around. Now, I brought it up on the deck to use it. Um, the hose is plenty long, but I wanted it up on the deck so it didn't get tangled and stuff. 
the maybe it's just because these tires and the feet on it are new but they left marks on the deck so i mean i'm power washing so i just power washed the marks right off the deck but i was uh, a little disappointed that every time i moved it there was a mark so anyway it's a small disappointment but i figured i should mention it but the hose that's another thing and this is true with every pressure washer this thing is a rigid hard hose and having 20 feet of hose really means you have about two feet of hose because it gets all tangled and scrunched up and everything it's a pain but anyway uh i suppose that comes with the territory it's of course more noisy than an electric but it wasn't so noisy that i needed hearing protection you know i'm, I'm a good distance away from the engine and it didn't really bother my ears i don't know what the decibel is on it but it uh, definitely didn't seem like it was overly noisy so overall impression of course is i really like it it is very well built it's dewalt so you could expect that made in the usa it has a honda engine and we all know how good honda engines are so over the test of time that should last a good good long time and i should be able to use this heck i want to power wash everything now i didn't use the soap and quite frankly, I don't like using the soap mixed in through all of this. I, I don't think the soap is good. I think just run water through it. And if you want to use soap, use one of those secondary soap cannon type things that connect on the end of the power washer and spray through the soap, not mixing it through the engine with the water and everything and through the pump. I, I really don't like those. Um, I've had bad experiences with them. So I'm going to just use the water through this. And then if I want to use soap, I'll get a secondary device to spray soap. So the first impression of the DeWalt 3100 PSI pressure washer with the Honda GVC 170 engine on it. Oh yeah, very good machine. And I hope it lasts a long time because I really enjoy it and I wanna enjoy it for years and years to come. The deck is nice and clean and it's gonna be ready for those before and after pictures. And I will show them to you next Saturday. I promise as long as that, I will work my butt off to get that fascia on as long as it shows up this Tuesday. But until then, I will see you when I am doing more stuff.